Well, Texas A&M Jr. is making his trivia game debut on Jeopardy's College Edition. And although being flown out to Los Angeles and meeting Alex Trebek <laughs> were highlights of his contestant experience, KAG's HD News reporter So Young Kim shows us how, more than the money, the best takeaway for this Aggie was something sentimental. A junior from Texas A&M University. For Tucker Pope, the competition started long before he stepped foot on the Jeopardy stage. I was so nervous. It, it was hard to eat. It was hard to sleep. Uh, I was just running on adrenaline the whole time. Tucker's journey started nearly two years ago. Two years ago, I took the online test, had an audition in New Orleans, didn't do so great. Went back, took the online test again last March. I uh, got an interview in Nashville in May and waited until Thanksgiving to hear back. The second time was a charm. The Jeopardy College Championship happens just once a year and he was one of 15 students selected to be on the show out of more than 12,000 applicants. Tucker says preparing for Jeopardy isn't something you can cram for, but looking through previous clues on J Archive and watching actual Jeopardy episodes helped. Other than the $100,000 grand prize, Tucker had another goal in mind. I got to represent Texas A&M. I love this university. I wanted to, to put its name out there. And says the best part about his experience is something money can't buy. Met all the other contestants and got to know them. We all became best friends. And so right now we all have a Facebook group together. We all, we all tweet at each other. Uh, and we've been, we've been having uh, Google Hangouts. A chance of a lifetime Tucker and his new friends will never forget. In College Station, So Young Kim, KAGS HD News. That's pretty cool. Well, Tucker's quarterfinal round airs tomorrow at 2.30. Tune in to find out if he advances to the semifinals.